elderly one you knew, grandma couldn't part with and faces the wall. You remember the day you took them all down while she was out buying groceries, how each nail pulled out of the drywall was less of a reminder of our expiry date, how we're wrinkling like fruit left in the bowl, how your fingers cracked and your knuckles popped and she didn't say a thing, but all the once jealous crooked photographs straightened themselves. And you think you're the silent tick of an unwound clock, but I think you're trumpets. I think you're Ella and Sinatra and Aretha. You are Big Ben beautiful. You are shiny shoes and pinstripe suits. And the way my mother says daddy is the only Polaroid safe from the fire. Grandpa, I know you know how to break the way strong men like you aren't supposed to. Because it's getting harder to hear her and you wish you listened every time you hushed because you're not blind yet. And you still wake up to your first, to your first wife's face. Because you're not blind yet and you can't see your first wife's face, but you still wake up to her coming in her sleep. And how can you sing all your favorite songs when the grandfather clock metronome is going way too fast? How can you concentrate on being soft when all you can think is that we are hard and we are rusting and we are dizzy? We are swinging pendulums constantly going nowhere. But remember who you are. You're the one who slips two knees into our handshakes. You're the one who always smells like leather and sings Conway Twitty to all the pretty ladies. You're the one who waltzes alone while your second wife makes supper. And that's all right. Do whatever you have to to hold on to yourself. You are a Louis Armstrong record that sounds new each time the needle touches the vinyl. Don't let me be afraid of getting old like that. Try and find 